This is the hydrogen powered Pinaferina designed Enigma GT. What's good guys, welcome back to Ron's Rise, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to another video where next year Pinaferina turns 95. And this important birthday will be celebrated with surprises that the Italian company is currently keeping to itself, but this special hydrogen 2 plus 2 provides a preview at the Geneva Motor Show. It's called the Enigma GT and it is a entirely virtual design study that explores the combination of beauty and technology representing the beginning of a path that will develop over time. Now, the elegant lines hide a hydrogen fuel internal combustion engine that drives the rear wheels coupled to an electric motor on the front axle. Now, this configures an all-wheel drive traction that promises great fun and there's also artificial intelligence and autonomous driving now the rear mid engine layout made it possible to optimize the aerodynamics of the front of the enigma gt and reduce the frontal area now the cabin is illuminated by the generous glass and large continuous windshield that offers panoramic visibility and the front fenders connect to the low smooth and extremely reduced front end which incorporates all lighting functions in a central light bar. Note, there's distinctive signs of that Pinaferina design, such as the rear fins and the particularly aerodynamic roof line. Now, to get on board, the roof lifts together with the dashboard and windscreen, a detail that recalls some Pinaferina concept cars from the past. Now, the interior design aims to enhance lightness, and the dashboard is aeronautical inspired and integrates a liminar airflow for ventilation. Now, the multifunctional steering wheel features a touch display and various controls, while the inner ring with a transparent glass display provides essential information to the driver and entertains passengers. Now, the driving experience is then improved by augmented reality driving assistance, a layer of augmented reality powered by artificial intelligence that assists the driver in real time. For example, it provides points of interest or POI and integrates the functions of advanced driver assistance systems or ADAS. And for long distances, you can also count on autonomous driving. Now, there are many active aerodynamic elements on the Enigma GT. The active grill shutters, which reduce airflow. The active front wheel deflectors, which reduce the resistance generated by the front wheels. The active aero tail, which changes the position of the delta wing and diffuser. And active based on bleeding, which reduces the depression downstream of the vehicle and therefore the resistance generated by it. Now, thanks to all this and the tapered lines, as well as the optimized underbody, the aerodynamic drag coefficient is equal to CX.24. While maintaining significant downforce, the drag coefficient of the Enigma GT combined with this reduced frontal section results in a CDA value of less than 0.48, record-breaking aerodynamic resistance in this segment. Because with the chassis, this is a carbon fiber monocoque and carbon panels, you're looking at a 0 to 62 miles per hour or 0 to 100 kilometers in just under four seconds with the electronically limited top speed of 250 kilometers an hour. And that's achieved by a couple of things like the weight distribution being 46% front and post 54% with a weight of 1,690 kilograms. So with the technological design of the Enigma GT, what do you guys think? Is this something that Pinaferita can design in the future for mass production? Drop those comments down below. And if you guys wanna help further support the channel, check the links down in the description below and subscribe to the channel, but click the notification bell so you don't miss one video. And with that said, you guys, we'll talk to you guys. We'll talk to you guys in the next video. Peace.